Hmm. Oh, hi, baby. Welcome home. I missed you. How was work? Glad to hear it. After how stressful you've had it, you deserve a break. I know, I know, but at least it's calmer than the last few weeks. Now just sit down and let me cook you a delicious dinner. It's my turn. Hmm? <laughs> what are you doing in here? I gave you an order, didn't I? I told you to relax by the TV while I was making dinner. My baby has had a long day, and I wanted to treat you with something extra special. <laughs> okay, okay, I'll just stop. I'll let you help out. I give. I give. <laughs> Are you happy? Okay, well, you can start with the carrots over there while I continue with these meatballs. It's a family recipe. My mom taught it to me when I was 12. Meatballs. Overcooked potatoes sauce and veggies. You're going to love it. It's a true Swedish classic. I overcook them so they're easy to smash later when you eat. Trust me on this one. <laughs> baby, baby, you know I don't have much of a singing voice. Okay. I can't say no to those puppy dog eyes. So, what do you say we take tonight's dinner in the living room and watch Deadpool together? Come on, you prefer the second movie? The second one's okay, but the first movie's just pure gold. Sure. I loved seeing him in a more serious view, opposed to his strange humor, but if I'm being honest, it doesn't have much rewatch value. Yes! Baby, are you okay? Oh my god, baby, you're bleeding. Come on, sit down, let me have a look at it. Remind me to never allow you near a knife again. Oh god, this is deep. How do you even manage to cut that deep with that little thing? How do you feel? Are you sure? No weakness or dizziness? If you do, promise you'll tell me. Good. Bring your hand under the faucet. We're going to get all that nasty bacteria out. Just hold it there for a second. You're okay. What? <laughs> this is no laughing matter. You gotta stop laughing. It is too. Look at that. You could have cut off your finger. So stop grinning. Okay. That should do it. What band-aid do you want? Boring beige or the Sleeping Beauty one with glitter details? <laughs> What? I was babysitting Clara, and you know how she refuses to use any band-aid other than princess ones? And seemingly as often as kids get into stupid situations, it's just as well to always carry some. Of course she did. This time two, actually. One on each day. The first one. She tried jumping off a very slippery chair in the kitchen and landed straight on her face. And then last Friday, she rode her bike right into the Anderson's fence. I had to take her to the emergency room. Lost three teeth that day. One upon impact and the other two in the ER. <sighs> what am I supposed to do with that kid? So... 
Which Band-Aid? Sleeping Beauty it is. I have to. It's my job to worry about you, darling. How else am I going to make sure you don't get into any trouble? No, oh, please. That innocent smile isn't going to fool anybody. I know how many crazy ideas you have. And I'm here to maybe not stop you, but at least make sure you do it safely. Then you don't get hurt any more than necessary. I will never get bored of taking care of you, baby. But if I could take care of you as my full-time job, I would take the chance any second. My sweet, impulsive, drop-dead gorgeous fiancé. <laughs> I'm still having a hard time wrapping my head around that one. Fiancé. Thinking of all the years we spent together and all the years that we have left. Well, just be the 50% that actually makes it. Because, baby, you're the love of my life. And I'm never going to get enough of you. I will never become bored or tired or catch feelings for someone else. Because you are my everything. Look how beautiful your finger is now. Just as beautiful as those adorable dimples of yours. <laughs> I believe that's my cue to get back to dinner. Don't even think about it. If you're not going to relax by the TV, you're at least going to relax right here. Have a glass of water. Food will be done in about an hour. <laughs>